sitting down with us now at Miami Heat Media Day, Boy Wonder himself, Tyler Hero. Tyler, thanks for joining us, man. Really appreciate it. Thanks for having me. Tyler. If you would uh, hit the uh, the microphone, it's oh, very sensitive. Thanks for having me. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I had the thing like you. The, no, uh, no, uh, no, we, no, that's probably no. Wish. The reason why I have this is because I don't do that. All right, yeah, cool. He yeah. leans too I much. Need, I need one of those. <laughs> I then. lead too much. Uh, Tyler, you're uh, you obviously had a, I'm sure a whirlwind summer, but uh, your troll your troll game online was very funny. I mean, with uh, with everything that was the fallout from it, is that like how much fun did you have? I guess with that with just uh i guess getting to mess with everybody online after all the damian lillard stuff and dust settled uh yeah i had, I had a lot of fun uh <laughs> I worked on my game and I worked on my troll game this summer, so I'm, I'm doing good. It was very top notch. You had uh, you had this thing uh, that you did over the summer when you were working out with Drew Hanlon. It was adorable, like little uh, notes from your daughter wanted to, uh, I guess, uh, have some goals for the season. Where did that Where did that come from? Uh, that was all Drew. So I walked in. I walked in the gym one morning and I was just sitting on the on the bleachers. And I walked in with my daughter, so it, I knew my daughter. Well, and my daughter's one, so I know she didn't write that. <laughs> <laughs> so that Drew, 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 started with Drew. So Drew, Drew was writing that all summer. Every time I came into the gym, he had, he had something new for me. By the way, I would like to blame you because of your troll game. You sent out a, a, a tweet with a, a cap on it. Mm -hmm. Oh, my. So for the next three weeks, no like, cap. What does he mean no by cap. that? No cap. So I'm, you, not, I'm like, dude, stop. 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 Why can't I use that term? Because no. Why? Say it. Too intangible. No cap. That's why. That's why. <laughs> that's why. So it's your fault. It's a, just because that's what he does. He, he's trying to. I like it. <laughs> can we, can, can, what was cap? Can, can, I, can that be revealed? What, were, what was that? What was I the mean, cap we've over? seen it. We've seen what was, what was cap. I mean, everything that they that they people were saying was all cap. Was it more annoying hearing what people think of you, like all that outside noise, or is it more just annoying because it's like a lot of BS just swirling around you? Uh, probably more of the it's a lot of bull. Yeah, just a lot of different sources who aren't sources saying things that they don't know. But it's it's part of the business, you know, and that's what you realize. And it's somebody's job to report. So. As you get older, you learn how to deal with this a little bit better because yeah, I definitely. would imagine this happening to like you think of Jaime and and you think of Jovic and and they're in it too. Mm -hmm. You're probably handling it a lot better than they are simply because you're more established. You know you can play. You got your money, and it's just a matter of look. I'm gonna do what I do, and right. whatever happens happens. Yeah, it was just a matter of me wanting to know where I was gonna be. You know, I kind of went the whole summer and like a. In yeah. the middle, just not knowing where I was, you know, right. where I got I was you. with the heat or someone else. So I'm good though. I'm happy to be here and I'm ready to hoop. You're um was was how tough was it, Tyler, just as a competitor, having to miss the playoffs last year? Because you know, one of the things that I thought was BS was people were like, Oh, well that's addition by subtraction I have a Tyler Hero. They mm -hmm. needed you, man. Like I I mean I, I think yeah. you probably looked especially in that Denver series, like yeah. Like how, how how difficult was that for me from a competitive standpoint? Not getting that opportunity to provide uh, that that offensive punch that they needed. Mm -hmm. No, it was it was tough. You know, just like you said, being the competitor, you know that I am, to not be able to go out there and compete at the highest level. Such a fluke injury, too. Right. Just like just yeah, yeah. <laughs> hustling it happened quick too. Yeah, and um, did you know right away? That someone right because you'd still play. He no. shot. He <laughs> shot a three. No, I thought it was. I just thought I sprained my hand or something. Right. And then once I shot, that's when I knew it was broke. Right. Now when when I went to the back too, they like my one of my bones was like in my palm. <sighs> they like pushed it back, and that's when they said it was broke before the X-ray. Uh. So that's when you know I figured I'd be out for for a while, and then um, yeah, it was tough walking it, for sure. Yeah. I like I, I just I just could imagine. Like, you wait the whole year to, you know, because it didn't, he got hurt last year, and you're like, okay, I've been working for this moment right here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to ball out. You go die for a ball and then break your hand. You're like, ah. I was playing well, too, in the first right. first quarter. I was playing well, and then uh, even as this playoffs went on, you know, we played two or three teams that I played really well against was the Bucks and then the Knicks. Right. Both played drop coverage. Both would have had to make an adjustment, so. Um, you know, it was tough. 
Tyler, um, your your goal, like you did say, like 26 points per game, that's kind of like one of those things that was put out there by your trainer. How do you get there? Like, what do you think is, what are the next things that you really want to take a step into to make yourself, uh, you know, hit that all-star level? Six man of the year, maybe it could have been an all-star that year, but what do you think is the next thing for you to, to hit that uh, level? I would say just getting to the free throw line and say more free throws and more threes. I mean, this sounds simple, but it really is. Right. It's um, five more points is all it is all I need to, to get there. Right. So, at the end of the day, just being more efficient in, in in everything, and then get to the line more and shoot more threes. Is is it? That seems like the the next step, but just having the confidence to take all those shots and be aggressive with the basketball. Yep. Is that something that's kind of grown each year? Because early, it, it never fails. When new players come to the Heat, mm. they always defer. Right. And so it takes them a while uh, until everybody says, no, you go, you mm-hmm. go. And right. so now you're to that point where now all these things are attainable because you feel that you can be aggressive and do all these things and feel comfortable doing it yeah we have a we have a really good you know group of guys that um i feel like everyone plays and fits into a role um and there's multiple roles that guys can play um so I, i'm excited to, to be a part of it and i think you know there's a great opportunity no cap no cap <laughs> Dude, what <laughs> you're supposed to just do this you're supposed to just <laughs> Use it in the right time. Uh, just before we get you out of here, Tyler, uh, Jimmy Butler's hair, your thoughts? <laughs> look at me. <laughs> that says it all. You know, you know what? You know, you know. Nope. You nope. Know. I want to know his thoughts, Leroy. I, it's beautiful. It looks good. I agree. Good stuff. I agree. You should pull that off. Tyler, we appreciate the time, man. Thanks for the fun, man. And uh, we're looking forward to this year. Thank you guys for having me. All right. We'll be back with more after this.